well, it's actually not morning. It's actually afternoon. Mm -hmm. Good afternoon, you guys. Me and Jesse just got finished recording um, that video that we talked when we talked about just kind of how she feels about my skin and stuff like that. So we just got finished recording that. Now we're gonna go off to the gym. Uh, what are we doing today? She doesn't know yet. I haven't yeah. told her. <laughs> uh, we're gonna be doing. I'm doing. I'm doing deadlifts, and I'm gonna be doing deadlifts for the first time in a while. A lot of people have been asking me. Uh, they always ask, like, yeah, we always see you do squats. We haven't seen you do deadlifts in a while, and honestly, it was because I kind of hurt my lower back a while ago. Nothing too crazy, but then it just kind of threw me off of doing deadlifts, and then I just never started incorporating it again. So I'm gonna start doing deadlifts again. So, but that being said, deadlifts, and then I'm, the rest of it's gonna be a back day. Whoa! Is what we're doing a back day. Back. So I'm not sure. Do you want a deadlift? Uh, sure. Sure. All right, we're both deadlifting today. So that's what's going on. That's what's on the agenda. I hope you guys have a great day, and thank you for checking out the video. Like I said, I haven't done deadlifts in a really long time, so I'm thinking I'm gonna do, so that set of 225 actually felt pretty good, and I was pretty happy with how my, my lower back felt in it during it, so I think I'm gonna try and do a three by three, so three sets of three with 315 pounds, so just add another 45 on there, and we'll see how that feels. A lot heavier than I thought it was gonna be. So I think I'm gonna move down to 275 and just do three sets of three with that. That should be heavy, but not too heavy. Keep it close to your body. That was a really solid workout. I'm really happy after not deadlifting for like four months to be able to hit 315 for one. Honestly, when I'm looking back on it, I was definitely being a little overzealous, I guess you could say, by trying to get a three by three for 315 pounds. But I was able to get 275 pounds for my first time deadlifting in a while. That's really good to me. I'm sure the form wasn't the perf wasn't the best, and I'm sure, you know, obviously I should have been deadlifting that whole time, and that's my bad, and I'll take full ownership for that. But it is what it is. I'm really happy with it, and now I know what I can build from. You know, I have a, a weight that I know is around my max. You know, 315. I, well, looking back at the footage, it wasn't really that slow, but I I know that I'm pretty much around the same strength level that I was before I kind of just stopped deadlifting. So that's good. So I know where I can kind of move from, and that I'm I'm happy that that happened. So that being said, I'm at Chipotle. Me and Jess are at Chipotle, and we're gonna get some food. People always ask me what I get at Chipotle, and it depends on the day and like pretty much how many calories I've eaten, but what I got today and what I get about probably about 80% of the time is a burrito bowl with brown rice, black beans, um, fajita veggies as well, and then I get chicken, um, mild, medium, and corn salsa, and then I get extra lettuce. The reason I do that many salsas and then extra lettuce is because they're very low in calories and they fill you up pretty good, so it's not that many calories for the whole thing, but it fills you up pretty good, and then also, Always, always, always use this salsa. It's the best, or this hot sauce. It's the best one. So I'm gonna go ahead and eat this. Jesse got a nice big burrito. She's gonna eat. 
back home now. I just finished editing uh, the morning notes with me and Jesse. That'll be up before this video is up, so you guys hopefully would have already seen that. Uh, that video was really fun to, to film and really simple to edit. So it's already 5:36 right now in the day. Also, I want to show you guys this. I just got all of this a uh, new package from my oatmeal. Check out all these like crazy oatmeals that I made. This right here is they actually have cream of wheat so can you see that this is cream of wheat so i made it like s'mores flavored so i named it some more wheat get it i'm not very clever and then this one i just really wanted to make like a chocolate peanut butter only blend so i made name that rip off reese's that's just oats everything else is gonna be oats and granola um their granola is really good this is the pumpkin amaretto i think it's this is only seasonal for um for like you know fall season and then this is just their regular granola if you guys have ever had their granola you guys know that it's really good also um i just decided to order some of their house blends so you guys know that team oats is a house blend you know it's that's my brand but it's a house blend of oatmeal that they have they also have other house blends so i decided to order their the pumpkin spice s'mores i think i got two bags of that yeah i got two bags of the pumpkin spice s'mores and then I got the, the salted caramel apple pie. I really, I'm really excited to try that. So, as always, my oatmeal is always hooking it up. I'm really excited. I, you guys know how much I love oats, so I'm really excited to try all of this stuff out. Um, yeah, and then the rest of the day should be really relaxed. I'm um, just going to be chilling at home by myself, probably. Nothing too crazy. Uh, yeah, today's just a really relaxed day. I got a lot of work done, which is good, but nothing like I'm not going anywhere special or anything like that. In this video, I just want to say thank you guys and, and thank you guys for all of the support that you guys have been giving me and, and just I, I know I say that all the time, but I, I want you guys to understand that I really mean that. You guys are the reason I'm able to do all the things that I do, the reason I'm able to go to the gym when I go to the gym and, and just you guys are my support system and, and a lot of you guys have become really close friends to me. A lot of you guys have, obviously you guys are just so supportive of me and the nice comments that I get and even the mean comments that I get just everything you guys are the reason I'm able to do what I do and I just I really want you guys to understand that I really do appreciate it and I really do appreciate your guys support even your criticism but mainly just the the nice comments that you guys leave and and the the amount that you're concerned about you know my family about my well-being about what I'm doing and all this stuff I just I just want to say I really appreciate it and I just appreciate you guys so much and I just I want you guys to understand that I really, really appreciate you guys. So, thank you guys so much. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. There was one other thing that I wanted to say. Oh, yeah. Look up over him. <laughs>